two points ahead of ninth place New York Red Bulls who are in action right now against Columbus but also just a point off fifth place Atlanta so very tight in the Eastern Conference postseason race at the moment it's two weeks tomorrow that Major League Soccer's regular season comes to a close with decision day taking place and everybody in action Montreal will be hoping to finish above the line here's Brogiard as he pushes forward down that right side straight into the side netting Montreal will be just around the Golden Horseshoe in Hamilton to face Forge of the Canadian Premier League on Wednesday night in the semi-final of the Canadian Championship. Alan Chapman getting the yellow card out here early. Thinks that technically he's better now and just the fact that he's had a run in the side has really helped with that confidence. Here's Ibrahim up against Bradley. It's Sanusi Ibrahim battling into the box. He wasn't far away, he let that one go with a lot of power, and it's a corner for Montreal. Sorio back in the starting lineup tonight, feeds Richie Larea. It's tangled up there with Samuel Pierre, his Canadian international teammate, but Osorio with a chance to get a shot away, and it's over for a goal kick. Nice play. And now Osorio. This is Mullins. Schaffelberg is off to the races down the left side, trying to get away from Waterman. If Mullins can slide it through, Camacho getting back. Schaffelberg got there first, but Camacho's there to sweep up. Great save. Here's Osorio in space now down the left side. He's got support from Schaffelberg there. It's Jacob Schaffelberg, and well saved by James Pantamis. Great save. It's wonderful football, two amazing passes, one from Bradley, then from Delgado, and you could see even a third from Azorio, the timing of it. But brilliant save. First corner here for TFC as it's played in by Jonathan Azorio. Mavinga got ahead to it. And it goes to Larea. Now Delgado. Looking for Jaquil Marshall Rutty, it came off Miller. Marshall Rutty has it with a lovely cross in. Schaffelberg with a header wide. Yeah, he's got his score. Could be Bradley just to chip it in towards the back post. Akello is forward. Mavinga is in the box as well. Mullins will drive it, and Akello got a foot to it. Back it comes towards Delgado and Mavinga, who both had the swing at the ball. Mihailovic with this corner. Can Montreal? Find a way to take the lead here just before the break. Ibrahim's header goes all the way across. Delgado will chase for CF Montreal. If it stays this way across the league, they will finish the night outside the playoff places in the Eastern Conference standings. Since the 1-0 loss at home to Nashville back on 11th of September, his Mihailovic fouled by Akello. Would have been away there. This is a yellow coming the way of Noble Akello. Torres into the path of Waterman. He's got Brogiar for support down that right side. Zachary Brogiar's ball in and Ibrahim got to it. And Montreal have the lead here. Inside the first 10 minutes of the second half. Sanusi Ibrahim given the start tonight by Wilfried Nancy and he repays his manager's faith with a huge goal for Montreal's playoff push. One side to the next, then a ball into box from Zachary Brogiard in a brilliant area in between defence and goalkeeper. Hesitant Westbrook doesn't come with authority and Ibrahim puts his head out, doesn't really get anything on it, but just the indecision just causes it to just drop at his feet and he's got the simplest of tappings. TFC had a better second half, but when they're on their game, they're as good as anybody in this league. Yellow card for Azorio. Lovely little nutmeg there from Larea Piet gets back, gets his foot in the ball. Into the path of Schaffelberg on that far side. The cross trying to find Josie Altidore, who gets the header there, but straight at Pantamus. Azorio to take it here. In towards Altidore, up the post. No, it's a save. I'm sure it was Pantamus Luke. To be in the back of the net. Really bad marking and Pantamus with a miraculous save. Doesn't even know who does it, just puts his right arm out and hope. Here's a Callo. Bit of momentum now about TFC going forward as it's played through. Richard O'Reilly is in round the back for TFC. 
Still going as Camacho did enough. Larea is denied. Joaquin Torres trying to get on the end of this one down the right side. Up against Larea. Torres tries to pull this one back into the middle. Mahalovic! And it's gone out for a corner. Oh, I think it was Auro. Waits on the, the development of the play in the middle. Brilliant play. And Mahalovic just has too long. It is Auro. Gets a right toe to that one. Tries to pick out the corner. Sorio's ball in. Brings it down. Arrow goes for goal. Pantamis with the save. Ball played into the path of Schaffelberg. Twisting and turning there. Gets it in towards Osorio. Now Altima. Bradley's ball forward. Piet heads it back. And now it's a chance for Janssen the substitute. And he should have done better. What a miss. Osorio down the far side. Now Larea into the path of Pozuelo. Miller will look to clear. Wasn't the best clearance. Drops back for Pozuelo. Pozuelo's ball in. This is Josie Altidore. Saved by Pantamis. Was probably the final action of the game. I thought it was a foul in the box. There it is there. A little bit of a push from Mikel and Miller. If it went in the back of the net, who knows? But Pantamis with another wonderful save. Montreal holding on to a 1-0 lead deep into stoppage time here at BMO Field. Cosuelo and Altidore standing over this free kick. It's Josie Altidore! With the last kick of the game! Josie Altidore ties it up and provides a huge blow to Montreal's playoff hopes! James Pantamis will want to forget He's been tremendous, he's made so many great saves, but when it matters most, he just leaves too much there for Altidore, eh, Matt? It's not even right inside the post, he should save it, he gets there. And then George has dropped two points. It is over at BMO Field. Dramatic finish here.